Hello every pony and welcome to Equestria Bound episode number 13 and we are back in Philadelphia where everything is nice and sunny and bright. I am Serene Inc as always and with me is... I am Tiger Skunk only 50% of the time. <laughs> only 50% of the time huh? Yep. Well, you're always Serene Inc, but only 50% of the time I'm Tiger Skull. I see. I see. I have I to have different identities, too. I see, said the blind man to his deaf wife in the dark room. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, we're in the desert. And what is in the desert? I have no idea yet. <laughs> uh, apparently more tunnels still. Yes, lots and lots of tunnel. Lots and lots of tunnel. You could have taken the bus. Could I have taken the bus? I didn't know there was a bus. Yeah, there's a bus stop. Oh well. We're on our way, drugs. 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 What you got? Meth? Heroin? Wait. Next day mail. I wonder if the megaphone... I mean, it doesn't say it's better, but I wonder if it's... Because it's more, like, meant for her, if that would be technically better. Like, say... I don't think so. Same it wouldn't. Like it would be value. blinking if it did have a higher attack power. Well, no, not like higher attack power, but like same attack power. But like since it's meant for her, she wouldn't like miss so much. Yeah. I don't know. If I won't buy it. Do you know that I need to withdraw at least? Gosh, I need to do at least a thousand. Cause I need to buy the uh, coins of peace as well. Oh gosh, thousand five hundred on those. Uh, hang on. Sell. I'll sell my lawn dart, and then I'll buy next day mail. 95 offense. Nice. Now I need coins of peace. Each one is 1500. Of course, I need to make sure they have some space in their inventories for it. We will eat the trot sandwich because it really doesn't do us any good except for making us faster. Yes, it makes you trot the trot does make us faster. But can you clop the clop? I don't think we want to be clopping. Why? Because clopping is a bad thing. Clopping is a bad thing? Clopping is a bad thing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's a reference to something else that you do. No way. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that is what Are it is referred serious? to. Serious? Yes, that's what it's referred to as when you're doing it to ponies. Are you? They call it clopping. They call it clopping. <laughs> that <laughs> everything is ponies. <laughs> everything is ponies. Clopping. That doesn't. That, that, why? That, that doesn't even make any sense. Wow. Kids, don't look it up, please. <laughs> Alright, we gotta go around the uh, traffic jam up here, it looks like. I'm going the wrong way, though. You should talk to that, that pony guy. This he guy? sells things for Apple Bloom. Oh, Ratchet. And Clink. 
I need to buy me a ratchet. Oh no! I didn't realize that thing was coming to attack me. I'm really, I'm all playing rough this late into the game. Yes. Well, he's playing rough, you know? <laughs> I'm all playing rough this late into the game. So I need 450 bits. I think that's what it said the ratchet was. <coughs> what do you want? I want to buy a ratchet, 425. You want to equip it. Joe also buy it for 25. Alright, we can go back in here and we can uh, deposit, not withdrawal. Keep. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Pause it. 50. Thank you. Very much. Hey. Hmm? I said, there you go. You know, this game would be so much easier. If you could just get lucky credit okay. card. Hee <laughs> hee hee. Our paradise exists beneath that hole. Fluttershy is very kind. Oh, she made it's the Fluttershy, not Talarama. Yes! The Monkey Cave song lives! These guys are running away from me, so I'm not even going to bother with them. It's Fluttershy! Fluttershy is really busy. Treating an injured monkey. Please don't bother her. Eep! Oh, Dinky, it's you. Sorry, I can't help you right now, but some of these monkeys are sick or injured. I can't just leave them here when they're in pain. Please don't be mad at me. Yep, that's Fluttershy. That's Fluttershy. I guess I can't do anything right now with Fluttershy, so let's head on up here. You know, uh, this is hi. totally unrelated, but... Star Ocean 3. There's a character in it named Sophia. She reminds me a lot of Fluttershy. Now, that said, why do I hate Sophia so much? <laughs> I don't know. Do you dislike Fluttershy? I do not. Quite the opposite, know. actually. I don't know, then. Scorpion became tame. It's a scorpion. Scorpion. Mm -hmm. Crested Buka. Inside was a picnic lunch. And Sweetie Bell just leveled up, gaining magic sealed Sigma. Are you sure it's not Epsilon? Yeah. Pretty sure. Okay. Sorry, I'm not Greek. I don't speak Greek. I speak American. <laughs> Oops. Sweetie Belle is dehydrated. Mm hmm. Can I heal that? Yeah, you should be able to. Healing beta on Sweetie Belle. Belle's sunstroke was cured. Yes, I can. What? What? We sleep in the desert a lot. It's a great way to get a tan, if you don't mind scorpions things. Annoying kids, what a group of brats. Scat, you little monsters. Scat? Scat, but that little bubble. I am the scat man. Hey, you are the scat man. Scat, 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 I can just use healing alpha on sunstroke. I need to waste all the mana for sunstroke, or for healing beta for it. But only like Sweetie Belle is getting the sunstroke. She's delicate. She doesn't. She she eats too much candy, not enough water. <laughs> 
Did Dinky just level up, or did that say Apple Bloom? I believe... I thought mm. I said Apple Bloom. Sure. Cup of Life Noodles. That's helpful. Ah, uh, it's a very, very good one. Just need to, like, keep track. Oh, magic, healing. Sweetie Belle again! Gosh dang it, Sweetie Belle. Does your sister never take you out enough or something? It's a bottle rocket inside. For some odd reason it was given to Apple... Oh yeah, Apple Bloom. Well, she, she is Rarity's sister, so... Kinda Let's makes sense that... Here. Desert gem digging place. Keep out. It's diamond okay, dogs! Okay, what the heck is that? Oh, that's great. Good hole. Good hole. Good hole. Arg! So we could find gems here, but it's all all we found is worthless sand. I'm starving. You, pony, give me something to eat. Pony has lots of stuff. What are you going to give me? Edible boots. Edible boots. Good pony. When we find gems, we'll give you a couple. Not a lot, but some. Sure, why not? Ugh, more digging. I think you can heal in that house, too. There's absolutely nothing in here right now. Yes, the Diamond Dogs. Fido, Spot, and Rover. Oh, I thought, you, I thought it was from... Uh, Phantom Pain. No. Big Boss, Cause, and Quiet. No, Diamond Dogs from Season 1, Episode 19, I want to say, but I don't think that's right. I don't think that's right. Whatever it was, it was a rarity episode. The one with the whining? Yes. This is whining. I am not whining. I am complaining. Do you want to hear whining? This is whining! I love that part. This whole, that's like the best part of the whole episode. It really is. Alright! We are in Manhattan! Okay, what track is this? This is definitely not an earthbound track. Don't immediately recognize it though. Time to make the magics. Now, I go. Right. Kind of sounds like Bab Seed, but that uh, it sounds different. Never heard of it before. No, so that is that's Bab Seed. Oh my God, that's Bab Seed. It's a Princess Peach Pony. Ain't bad seed if she's after you. Got a pony on her tail. Got a run, we got a bell. That's Bab Seed. Bab Seed? Bab Seed. It's a uh, uh, season four song. Isn't that Doctor Hooves? No, that's a Saturday Night Pony. Saturday Night Pony. Saturday Night Pony. And what does this pony do on Saturday night? I have no idea. It's the Saturday night pony turned back to normal. Oh my god, the Manhattan theme is Bab Seed. That's awesome. Oh, hi! And it's Crazy Taxi. Mad Taxi. Sorry, mad Taxi. Missed opportunity there. Missed opportunity. It revved and accelerated. Bam! I hit him with fire. 
That really did not do like anything to it. Red Taxi's offense is vulnerable to paralysis. You know, you'd think that fire would work really well on a car. You would think. Considering cars are fairly flammable. That's what I was thinking when they used fire on it. I'm like, it's a car. It makes sense now. Especially if you, like, hit the gas tank. But then again, gas tanks are designed Ow. as such Good that idea. there isn't a, there wouldn't be enough oxygen for a flame to be, you know, to sustain a flame. Right. Great, I'm lost in Manhattan. No one does anything. Grr. Jet Set's toadies stole everything from me, including my house and land. Weep, weep, they're evil incarnate. Lawyers, policemen, plumbers, everything that follows Jet Set. They're police men, ponies. not police ponies. No matter <laughs> how much you fight him, you can't win. You just end up sued, arrested, and toiletless. Hey, I'm okay. Just leave me to cry into my booze. Nosy. Jet set. It's a bar. Yay. The bar. What? Does Mr. Jet set come here often? Hello, wake up. Could never happen. Well, actually. I'm glad this song wasn't changed. Well, shouldn't be drinking cider. Or beer. Or wine. Or spirits. Shouldn't be hanging out here at all. What? Jet Set's here? I should. I don't have time for your games, kid. It used to be Jet Set's employer. Then I realized the schemes were making my company bankrupt. Tried to fire him, but somehow he managed to get the board to depose me. Now I'm homeless. Jet Set didn't used to be so powerful. I'm gonna find out his secrets. I'm spending time here watching to see if he ever drops in. I don't know why I'd expect him to come here. Just a hunch. I think you have to go to the theater. There's someone there who is in desperate need of restitution. There are five apples. If you eat one, how many are left? It's four. So four is left. Ah, it's not funny. Okay, here's another one. Miss Diamond Tiara's made smooth polish is made to order. Oh, puns aren't funny either. Jet set. Instead of Monotoli, instead of being the Monotoli building, it's Jet Set. Yeah. Colgate is so like who's everywhere. Jet Set? Who's Jet Set? I don't immediately recall. I feel That's... like I should know this pony, but I don't. Wait, it's only for Miss Tiara's use. He goes directly up to the 47th floor. Let's go! Okay. No mention of your hips? I guess not. Hi, are you a friend of Miss Tiara? It's okay to visit her here. But don't wander around the building. Some pony might be suspicious. Take a pot shot at you with a custard pie. As <laughs> with a custard pie and not a rifle. That's funny. It's Diamond Tiara. Oh look, it's a little blank flank dinky. Have you come here to beg for money? Don't you recognize me? I suppose you're just awed by my high class glory. I'm Diamond Tiara. I've climbed the social ladder, now I'm Mr. Jet Set's partner. And I give political and economic advice. I heard there was some ratty looking fool looking for Mr. Jet Set. Was that you, Dinky? This isn't the place for the likes of you. Get out! Now, loser! <laughs> I just got pushed out of the building. Out of her room, anyway. You must, you must never show your face around, Miss Tiara. You got that? 
Well, I don't seem to be able to do anything around here, I suppose. You haven't changed much, have you, Dinky? I'm filthy rich. Owner of barnyard bargains and diamond tariffs, father. To see she's going out and making a name for herself. I was getting a bit worried. Why don't you just scoot along and let us take care of everything? Filthy rich. Filthy rich. Please, call him Mr. Rich. Private elevator, not for operation by the general public. Gent set building manager. Alright. Don't you mean Honeyger? There's no crashing and we shouldn't <laughs> there's no crashing and we shouldn't explode. <laughs> so elevator goes down, but not like a airship. There's no crashing and we shouldn't explode. That that uh that really makes me feel comfortable. Yeah, that was pretty out there, actually. Department store. Let's see what else Manhattan has to offer. The bakery. I think we're looking for a theater. Dinosaur Museum. It's right below the, the, the museum. The museum. Oh, museum. Ah, Tapalo. Surprised it's not to pony. Please have your tickets ready. Want to buy a ticket? 30 bits, please. Let's give away tickets. You must pay 30 bits. There was that department store. It was right here, wasn't it? Well, that was the bakery. But the I'm not sure you right can there. enter the department store just yet. Temporarily closed. The department store is closed. What about the department store? Strange things started happening. Well, I need an ATM. That's usually what happens when a Walmart opens up. Strange things happen. Bakery doesn't have an ATM, but that's not a surprise. So there's one on a higher floor. That's. Mr. T Pony. Mr. T Pony. Mr. T Pony. So I need an ATM so I can get 30 bits if that's what I'm supposed to be doing. I don't know where to find an ATM. Anywhere in Manhattan. I do believe there's a hotel that has an ATM in it. Hotel. Yeah. You're right. I love it when I can recognize music. Because I very rarely ever am able to. Sure. I think he has well, if it's thought. pony related. I would think that nobody but you would be able to recognize it, because I sure wouldn't. I tend to recognize it most times. Show ticket. <laughs> Sorry, the show will be starting any moment. Wait. They're not ponies, they're people. That's awkward. <laughs> Lucky your eyes, Miss Scratch told me to let her in, so please come in. I have the feeling that it's a matter of the sprites weren't editable or something. Guess I'm okay. stuck here again. This time it's my own fault. I ran up huge room service bills. Guess I partied a little too hard a few too many times. <sighs> and Yay. see Vinyl Scratch's show again. I've got a real bombshell show for you tonight. Know what I'm talking about? Because I, I, I know who I'm talking about. DJ Pony and her extended Manhattan stay. Three, two, one, go! Please no dubstep, please no dubstep, please no dubstep, please no dubstep, please no dubstep. This 
same track as last time. Yeah. DJ Pony. Play the track again. Hmm? What is thing? Do what, what? Play the track again. I want to do something. Play the track again? Yes. Why? Because I want to do something. Okie dokie dokie. I'm playing the track again. Alright, hold on. Holding on. All right, go ahead. Here we go. Here we go. Listen close, this life turned its pages. Machiavelli here, spitting rhymes for the ages. Same things as ages, wise words spoken by sages. From sky till the Blackberry pages. Your crew don't phase us, we'll make you bust us pay us. Run up in your spot like CJ from San Andreas. I wrote this song a long time ago. A real long time ago. Feel me! I wrote this song a long time ago. It was the dopest song I ever wrote in 94. What can a brother do when half the people voted for W? Okay. That's... <laughs> Is that the track she's playing? Sure, let's go with that. Huh. Right. Well, anyway, I think this is a good spot to stop our episode because we're almost 30 minutes in. So, next episode, we'll figure out uh, what exactly it we have to do. Um, I need a diamond the size of your head. If you guys that, sure, come and see me. Yeah, next episode we will continue investigating Manhattan and see if we can't figure out where we're supposed to be going from here. Foresight and Colgate are everywhere. Mm -hmm. Anyway, thanks everypony for watching. If you enjoyed, uh, please feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. Please feel free to leave a rating and leave a comment. And we'll see every pony in the next video. Keep calm and pony on, every pony. See you later, folks.